I'm here with the Canon XF305 camcorder, and this is probably the queen of the camcorder fleet we have as far as Canon goes here at Crutchfield. And Canon was nice enough to let me borrow this camcorder to use uh, to film this year's Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas. I really put this camera through its paces at CES over the course of three days. We shot 104 videos. So let me tell you about my favorite features. Now this camera is a total powerhouse because it was able to really handle some of the harsh lighting conditions on the floor at CES. There was color temperatures all over the place with intense fluorescent lights and dark areas and everything in between. So this camera did the job and mainly because of the pro level guts inside. It takes uh, 50 megabits per second and that's a great data rate for capturing tons of Luma data. So because of all the low light situations that I shot, I was worried that I wouldn't get the best light in my footage, but we never had to use an outboard light once because of how well this camera captured uh, fine crisp details in low light situations. It also has 422 color subsampling, and that's a chroma subsampling rate that is on the professional level. It's what a lot of professional cameras use, so I was really blown away with how well the colors came out. So now that I'm back from CES and I'm starting to go through the footage and edit our videos, I'm really still continually impressed by how pristine this image quality is. And that's thanks in part to the three separate CMOS sensors that are inside this camera. There's a separate sensor for blue, separate sensor for green, and a separate sensor for red in here. And cumulatively, those add up to really, really impressive images. Now another thing that really surprised me about this camera was how lightly it treaded on battery life. We were using this Canon lithium ion battery throughout our 10 hour days on the floor and I never got through half of a battery. So that just kind of really speaks to how well this thing does on battery life. Now in terms of data storage, this camera records to two compact flash slots and one SD card slot. And every morning I started out the day loading up uh, two 32 gig Lexar cards into the camera. And on each of these, I got about 80 minutes of video footage shooting at maximum resolution. So I really enjoyed using this camcorder. And if you have any questions about it, feel free to give us a call.